Hello, this is Rakesh Rao from Coordinate Systems. In this GeoTools video, I'm going to show you how you can transfer extended entity data or X data from one entity to another. Now, in my previous video, I converted block attributes to X data and transferred it to this block. So, if, if I double click on this block, you can see that there are these attributes and they are now available as X data in this object. So that is the X data. The five attributes have been transferred as X data in this block. And we'll now see how we can transfer this X data to the bounding polygon of this shop. So we go to GeoTools, AutoCAD Map Tools, Data Convert Transfer, and choose this option here called Transfer Object Data X Data between two objects. You can also run it on the command line by typing gt underscore x for underscore od underscore xd. It's a bit long, but it explains exactly what it does. And the reason why this command is under the AutoCAD map tools is because it can also be used to transfer object data. If you're running plain AutoCAD or BricsCAD, the object table data option will be automatically grayed out and you have only the choice to select extended entity data. The first thing you must know is which application you want to transfer. So in my case, it is the suite info application that I want to transfer to another entity. I can choose the transfer options like whether you want to overwrite without prompting, whether you want confirmation, append and so on. There is also an option called export all tables by which you can export all the tables from the entity. So I leave this option now, ask for confirmation and click OK. You can now see that the command has done nothing as yet and has not yet started the transfer. But there is a useful piece of information here which says type the gt underscore xo command to start the transfer of object data or x data. So let us type gt underscore xo. Select source object. So this is my source object. Select target object. This is my target object. So you can see now that one extended entity of application suite info transferred. So likewise, I now need to just select my source, target, source, target, and so on. So it transfers the X data with ease. Now what happens if I try to transfer X data again to an entity which already has X data? So you can see that I get a warning message, overwrite existing entity data, yes or no. So this is as per my settings. You can choose to have this warning or you can choose to overwrite and go without asking for a confirmation. This is available only in GeoTools and in AutoCAD and BricsCAD it is available in two different locations because in AutoCAD we have grouped it under AutoCAD Map Tools here and in BricsCAD we have also grouped it under AutoCAD Map Tool but the AutoCAD Map Tools itself looks a little different but the way it operates is exactly the same so for example if you run this command here you can see the same interface like in AutoCAD. Thank you for watching this video and I do hope you find this tool useful. Do let me know if you have any questions. Thank you.